Look how small he is.
must take this little one as a trophy. Look how little he is compared to them. I'm not quite sure if I had the full set of this. I think that I did though. So, I'm not gonna take it. here. How can I serve you, my Thane? I've already provided you with the key to my museum. What else could you possibly want? To protect my research, for one. There are more cutthroat scholars out there who would steal my findings if they got the chance. And the excavations into Nichuan Zell are dangerous. Dwemer machines and traps still functional, even after thousands of years. You have my gratitude. That spider had been interfering with my excavations for months. As promised, is the key to the Dwemer Museum. Mind the displays, some of them are quite fragile. Let's see. Ah, so that's what happened to Stalin. Tragic. But I warned him he was leading those people on a fool's errand. Unfortunately, sometimes the stone of scholarship is built on the foundation of death. I'll inform the king. Here. I usually pay researchers for their work when they emerge from the ruins, but they won't be needing it anymore. Hmm. 
I had you figured for a maid. I think you'll appreciate this. It's about the Hall of the Dead. No, you can't go in there. I can't talk about it. Rest assured, the Jarl hears everyone's concerns. You will be able to visit the dead again soon. All right. I was going to suggest the Jarl hire someone to sort this mess out anyway. We've discovered that some of the dead have been... eaten. Flesh has been chewed off. Bones were snapped to get at the marrow inside. We haven't caught anyone or anything yet. It's like it knows when I'm there. If you can get to the bottom of this, the priesthood of Arke will reward you. Take my key and be careful. Hmm. New to Skyrim? I was confused at first, too. The Nords call their mausoleums the Hall of the Dead. It's where people in the city are buried. Fathers, forefathers, mothers, foremothers. Arke, one of the eight divines, god of the cycle of birth and death. It is his shrine people pray to when they visit the hall, that his divinity will watch over their ancestors on the way to the next life. Tread lightly in the hall. I don't think you belong here. Not many would walk blindly into a crypt smelling of steel and blood, but not fear. I feel the hunger inside of you, gnawing at you. You see the dead, and your mouth grows wet. Your stomach growls. It's all right. I will not shun you for what you are. Stay. I will tell you everything you have forgotten. You were young when you first tasted human flesh, weren't you? A brother or sister had died? An accident, of course. Then the hunger set in. Curiosity. What's the harm in just one bite? It's okay now. You found a friend who understands you. You can let go of your guilt. A lot of our kind block out the memory of their first meal. The shame is too much. But you don't need to hide anymore. Namira, the Lady of Decay, accepts you for what you are. She has a place for us where we can sate our appetites without judgment. Very well. But should the hunger call out to you, I'll be waiting outside Reachcliff Cave. Tell the people of Markarth that their dead are safe. My work is done here. Turned. What happened in the Hall of the Dead? Divines preserve you. You're a hero. We'll reopen the hall right away. Here, take my amulet as a reward. RK protect you. Old war 
Sovereign City underneath I'm Goyce's assistant to the shoe. I help her with the forge. Best steer clear if you don't want a steam centurion carving you up. The Silverblood family will be hurt. Yarrow can refuse to see me all he likes. He can't ignore us forever. Addressing a member of the Thalmor. Bask in it. As if this craggy wretch of a city could give birth to a superiorly bred Mur such as myself. No, I'm not from Markarth. I was sent here to lead the Thalmor's interests in this corner of Skyrim. It's my mission to root out all Talos worship in this city. It's a religious matter. The Thalmor do not recognize Talos as a god. He was only a man and does not deserve a place in our pantheon. The Empire has agreed to accept our beliefs, and its citizens have a responsibility to cease their heretical worship. You're awfully inquisitive, aren't you? I like that. Perhaps you'd care to solve a little problem I'm having. Ogmund the Scout. He's old, respected, and I know for a fact that he worships Talos in his home. But the Yaro has been hesitant to call for his arrest. I want you to break into his home and find evidence. We're the ruling body of the Orgmeri Dominion. Saviors of Myrrh. Victors of the Great War. The Empire exists because we allow it to exist. And I'm here to make sure the Jarl of Markarth remembers that. The Thalmor saved all of elven kind during the Oblivion Crisis. We've been watching over our lands for 200 years. We refounded the Old Mary Dominion, an alliance between us and our Bosma cousins. You might know them from their common name, Wood Elves. We intend to prove the superiority of Myrrh over man, one century at a time. All right, then. I'm sorry to drag you into Markarth's problems, but after that attack in the market, I'm running out of time. You're an outsider. You're dangerous looking. You'll do. You want answers? Well, so do I. So does everyone in the city. A man goes crazy in the market. Everyone knows he's a forsworn agent. Guards do nothing. Nothing but clean up the mess. This has been going on for years, and all I've been able to find is murder and blood. I need help. Please, you find out why that woman was attacked, who's behind Waylon and the Forsworn, and I'll pay you for any information you bring me. She's not from Markarth. The air about her screamed outsider. Visitors to the city usually stay at the Silverblood Inn. He was one of the smelter workers. I used to have a job down there myself, casting silver ingots. I never knew much about Whalen, except he lives in the Warrens, like all the other workers. They're remnants of the old rulers of Markarth, natives of the Reach, followers of the old ways. The Nords drove them out of the city, Ulfric Stormcloak and his men. That was about 20 years ago. But somehow they're still here, and they're killing people. Yes, it all started when I was a boy. My father owned one of the mines. Rare for anyone who isn't a Nord. He was killed. 
guards said it was just a madman, but everyone knew the murderer was a member of the Forsworn. I've been trying to find out why ever since. I've gotten nowhere so far. And then I got buried. I have a child of my own on the way. I swore I was going to just give up for my child's sake, but it's like my father's ghost is haunting me, asking me why. Keep your eyes and ears open. What is it? I'm right behind. As you wish, my Thane. Supposed to be in here. This is the last time I'll say it. Get out. Just... Why don't I get you something to eat? Mama and Papa will talk later. Beware the region northeast, across the river. Force One have taken refuge in Broken Tower Redoubt and Red Eagle Redoubt. Say the Stormcloak murdered the High King with his voice. Shouting him out? apart. As you command, my Thane. What do you need?
Silverblood family will be heard. Outsiders aren't trusted in Markarth. Best keep that in mind. The Thalmor know how to deal with Talos worshippers. Ah, there we have it. This will be all I need to have Ogman taken care of. I would like to personally thank you on behalf of myself and the Thalmor for your assistance. Here, for your work. All right, then. Ondolimar is the commander of the Thalmor in Marka. Keep an eye out for trouble. It's only a matter of time. There are so few pleasures in life as fine as your company. Safe, I hope. So you can cast a few spells. Am I supposed to be impressed? Come on in. The Silverblood Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. This is the Silverblood Inn. I'll let you figure out who owns it by yourself. Ah, yes. Rented the nicest room we had for a whole month. I think she's sitting by the fire. Poor girl. Remember, ale is cheaper than blood in Markarth. Unlike my husband, Clever, I watch after our guests. I should remind Clever to clean this place up. I'm what you call a soul sorry. I'm still a bit dizzy from everything. Just visiting. I had some business here. That's all. Was it that obvious? Damn. I must be losing my touch. I'm one of General Tullius's agents. I was sent to investigate the Treasury House and the Silverblood family. They own Sidna Mine, one of the toughest jails in Skyrim. I was hoping I could buy or steal the deed, but I don't think that's how things work here. Mark my words, Thonar Silverblood was behind that attack in the market, somehow. Better not talk. I have to head back to Cyrodiil soon. If I can't get you... Sure thing. It's yours for a day. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Let me know if there's anything else you need. I've seen you snooping around, asking questions. Back off. You don't want to know what happens to troublemakers here. We'll see. This is your last warning, outsider. We keep the peace here. Stay out of our business. A man like me makes a lot of enemies. They're always trying to cheat me. Hail, companion. Ow. 
outsiders. I'm sorry. We're only interested in helping our patrons. I'm afraid he's asked not to be disturbed. He has important business. Oh, I'm sorry to keep you. Head right in. I have records I need to tend to. You just let old Nana know if you need anything. All right, dear? What are you doing here? I told them no visitors. What did you expect? That no one was going to notice you butting into business that wasn't yours? The guards know who holds the purse strings in this city, and I don't like snoops. Mark Hearth is my city. You have no right looking into my business. Now get out. By the gods, Petrus! Never! Ah! Ah! I'm afraid he's asked. Oh, I'm sorry to keep you. Head right in. You I just let old Nana know if you need anything. All right, dear. What are you doing here? I told them no visitors. What did you expect? The guards know. Mark Karth is my city. You have no right looking into my business. Now get out. Never should have been uh, here. The God damn it. I don't want to fuck Mountie. What are you doing here? I what did you the guards know? Mark Karth is my city. You have no right looking into my business. Now get never should have come. Stop walking in my oh, fucking stupid NPCs. What are you doing here? I told them. What did you. The guards know. Mark Karth is my city. You have no right looking into my business. Now get out. For the firstborn! Is it. Oh. Never should have come here. I thought I heard something. My wife. They killed her. Damn Madanak. Damn his forsworn backside. 
Fine. You want to know what the Forsworn really are? They're my puppets. I have their king rotting in Sidna Mine. He was supposed to keep them under control. My prison. The source of half the silver in Skyrim. The most secure prison in Demriel. No one escapes. I thought keeping Madanok down there would keep him under control. When their uprising was crushed, I had Madanok brought to me. He was a wild animal, but a useful one. I offered him a stay from execution if he used his influence to deal with any annoyances that came up. Competitors, agents, idiots. So I've let him run his little forsworn rebellion from inside Sidna Mine. Now he's out of control. Madanak, the king in rags. While we were off fighting the elves in the Great War, Madanak was busy ruling over the Reach. Until Ulfri came and put them down. You already got what you wanted, you damn hound. This is your fault. You and Madanak are animals. And I'll see you both rot to death in Sidna Mine for this. Now get out of my house! Ungrateful piece of shit. Should have let them kill you. Disrespect the law and you disrespect me. Even hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. No, still here. I am sworn to carry your burdens. Suppose you did chant my sword. Bah. I have potions for disease, love sickness, irritating children. <laughs> Comes with living to a ripe old age. People start thinking there's something magical about you. Then, the insults. Still, a little knowledge of plants and potions can get you by. Not that anyone likes to admit buying things from you. See? I even have a little potion for the steward. Mind handing it over to him? Just say it should solve that problem he has. 
Thank you. So, you're interested in my potions and ingredients? Let me know if you need a cure. Or... I'm Bothella's assistant. I have... take a look. Now, you... A little bit of old reach magic can cure whatever ills you. 